Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a really quick grocery haul from Walmart. I am trying their grocery pickup service. This is the second time I've used it. Usually I use a grocery pickup service from another local grocery store in my area, but they charge a service fee to use their grocery pickup and it is totally worth it for the convenience of it all. So I haven't mind minded paying that service fee, but when I realized that Walmart offers grocery pickup for free, I wanted to try them out for a few weeks and see how much more money I can save and is it really worth, um, you know, the service, not having a service fee. I mean, of course it's not, it's worth not having the service fee because I'm saving $4.95 right away by using the Walmart grocery pickup service versus what I was using, but Walmart has a lot of different products than, than I'm used to. I'm used to the uh, grocery store that I use uh, and have used for years. And so that's where I want to see if the Walmart grocery service is really saving me money in the long run and if I like some of their like brands. Of course, Walmart has major brands that you can find at any grocery store, but then they also have like just some Walmart branded things. It's their great value brand as well, which you'll see in the haul a little bit. So this grocery haul was, I spent $84 and I have a week's worth of meals plan, about a week and a half actually. So we're doing tacos one night, uh, like regular ground turkey tacos. Another night we're doing shredded chicken tacos. Another night we're doing spaghetti. Another night we're doing grilled chicken grilled salmon, and then I always have like at least one night a week leftovers from things we've made during the week, and then I have stuff for snacks and lunches, and it is summertime, and so my kids are home, and so I got a few different things just for to have on hand just because it's summer and some things I wanted to try for some easy lunches, so let's get into the haul. Also, I did want to mention there is no protein in this haul because we usually buy all of our chicken, ground turkey, and all of our protein from Costco. So that's why you won't see any of any kind of like protein in the haul. And this is produce and dry goods and snacks and different things like that. So that is the explanation for that. So the first thing we have is I picked up some garlic bread and then this cheese. My daughter loves string cheese, so I also got some of that. And I picked up six of these dairy-free yogurts. My husband, or not my husband, but my son is dairy-free. So I picked up a bunch of these for him. And then we have some cilantro and some carrots here. I love snacking on those uh, in cilantro and orange juice for the kids. And I mentioned that we we're gonna have tacos one night, so I picked up shells, and then two different kinds of Frank's hot sauce, the buffalo kind, and then the original one. And we're having spaghetti one night, so that's what the pasta is for. My kids have been loving these uh, applesauce packets, and they're super easy for snacks. Next over here, this sourdough bread is a favorite of my kids. I don't actually eat that, but I also picked up some taco shells for our shredded chicken tacos, sweet potatoes, here's the produce I got, bananas, limes, and avocado and red onion for um, guacamole that I'm going to make and for us. This is another easy lunch item I picked up, the Lunchables, the rice, and then I love these Nut Thin Crackers. And to go along with the guacamole, those chips, and I love these Hint of Lime chips. They're my favorite. Okay, so the salmon I picked up, I have not had salmon like this in a long time. This is just prepackaged, but we had these when I was in Iowa, and my stepdad grilled them over um, a charcoal grill and they were just awesome. I picked up some of these chicken nuggets for easy lunches and then a can of Rotel and a can of corn. And then my husband wanted these sweet Southern tea. And then I, of course, picked up more LaCroix. 